about 20 years ago, when I was five going on six, I dressed up as Pennywise the Clown for Halloween. I wore the costume all day due to my school letting us wear them for parties in our classes. When we were dismissed from school, my father met me with a pleasant surprise. He was dressed in a yellow raincoat and had a hat on, and he was Georgie from the movie It. He held my hand as we went to the car, then we drove home. A few hours go by, and my father took me out to go trick-or-treating because my mother wasn't feeling too well. The night went on as scheduled, kids bombarding doors for candy, teenagers scaring each other, and parents losing their kids. Everyone loved our costumes. Again, I was Pennywise the Clown and he was Georgie from the 1990 It. My father held my hand in between each house and waited at the end of each driveway. One house took longer than others, and I remember that I was very anxious. Once I received my candy, I remember that there were more people than usual, and I had to run through a crowd to get to my father. I reached him, held his hand, and off we went, but it was the opposite direction of where we initially were going. I didn't think anything of it because of how young I was. We went down one of the dark back streets where our garbage was picked up for some reason, and we were walking unusually fast. I remember that I said, Daddy, but my father started moving faster and didn't answer me. Then all of a sudden, I heard my name yelled out from about 25 yards behind us, and it was my father's voice. I looked back and it was my father. I looked up at the person that I was walking with, and he had on the same costume as my dad, but when I looked closer, I noticed it wasn't him. I looked at my dad and yelled out to him. The man then let me go. And as soon as he saw my father, he started running. And my father was running full speed at us. The man took off down the alley, then through a backyard. My father reached me. He was out of breath while he was hugging and kissing me. Also asking me if I was okay. My father called the cops and explained to them that he lost track of me in a huge crowd at one of the houses and that there was some sick guy roaming our neighborhood. Once we got home, he told my mother everything that happened. He told her that a crowd gathered and some random guy with some costume, the same as him, walked up to him while I approached the porch. He told her that the guy said I was a cute kid. They wanted to just snatch me up in a joking manner. Then the crowd gathered even more, and he lost track of me until he saw us turn the corner onto the back street. And that's when he started to run after us and yell my name. Now looking back, I bet my father was losing his mind and probably wanted to kill that guy when he saw us together. Until this day, I'm grateful that my father found us when he did, because who knows what would have happened to me.